Welcome back to the Unlimited Detroit video page. I'm Steve Gary, and today we're going to watch the 1965 Spirit of Detroit Regatta. So let's go right to it. Okay, race fans, here we are in Detroit, 1965, the Spirit of Detroit Regatta. It's late August, August 29th to be exact, and 15 boats showed up for this uh, first ever race, or really second ever Spirit of Detroit race. First one was in 62. And the first heat comes out with the Miss Bardall and Ron Musson. Miss US 5 with Roy Duby. Saviors Mist with Walter Cade. Miss Madison with Buddy Byers. And the Such Crust with Bill Muncy. Bill Muncy actually driving for Jack Schaefer in this race. The one and only time. And there's Roy Duby and the Miss US 5 took over for Don Wilson who drove it in 64. And Walt Cade in the pink uh, U10. Saviors Mist. Oh, Roy Duby missed a buoy. He's got to go back around, pick it up. He was running in second. And while he's doing that, here comes Walter Cade. Take over second place behind the Bardall. As they go down the front straightaway on the Detroit River. Okay, here's the boats in the Heat 1B. The, the blue chip with Fred Alter, Gail's Rooster Tail with Jerry Shaneth, Mariner 2 with, War with Warner Gardner, and the Savers Probe with Red Loomis. There's uh, Colonel Gardner and the Rolls Powered Mariner 2, Jim Harrington's boat. Comes the Probe with uh, Red Loomis from California. Came in just to drive that boat into town. And old Uncle Jerry driving the Gail's Rooster Tail. Now here comes the uh, Heat uh, 1C with the Notre Dame, the Tahoe Miss, the Smirnoff, and the Budweiser. Budweiser is the four-seater, X-Tempo. There it is with Chuck Hickling driving. That looks like the My Gypsy, doesn't it? But it's not. <laughs> it's the Smirnoff with new paint job, red and blue, opposed to the mahogany and blue from the year before. Bill stands up and takes a bow. Ooh, Tahoe Miss takes a dive, and Notre Dame takes over the lead, but Chuck Thompson cuts over to the outside. Look at that, right through his rooster tail. They come down the back stretch. He cuts back over to the inside and takes over the lead. There he is. Chuck Thompson was a driving fool, boy. And he wins the heat by a boat length. Now for Heat 2A, out comes Jerry Shaneth and the Gales Rooster Tail. That's a nice shot of Jerry as he waves to the crowd. Okay, let's see who we have here coming around the turn. Rooster tail turn, it's Miss Madison with Buddy Byers and the rooster tail. Here comes Bill Muncy driving the big Such Crust 4. Bill Muncy with that Such Crust, I, I remember hearing him talk in the pits and he goes, the boat's got decent acceleration, he goes, but it sure don't want to turn. You get it going down into a corner and he goes, you really had to think way in advance when you wanted to turn that boat. Bill Muncy places second behind Miss Budweiser. He really gave that boat a ride. Now this should be the start of the final heat. Coming up with Miss Budweiser. Boy, that thing is hanging in there with the bar doll. Look at that. Oh, this is still the second heat. It's Fred Alter in the new blue chip, brand new boat that year. And Chuck Hickling in the four seed, Miss Budweiser. Comes 
the blue chip again. That's a good shot of Bill Muncy. His one and only race with the Such Crest 4. I will miss when they christened that boat. It's got the white stripes on it here. They christened it in Detroit. I think they put it in at the Whittier, as a matter of fact. And they invited a bunch of friends and stuff. And Tahoe Miss went out, and it stalled on the back stretch. And when it stalled, nobody could see it. And they didn't know where it was. It was all gray. It didn't have no stripes on it or nothing. It was just a two-tone gray. And so they decided right then and there, we got to make it more visible. And that's when they put the stripes on it. Notre Dame, always the bridesmaid, never the bride. That's right. Hale's rooster tail. Chuck Thompson. Followed by the Bardall. This is the final heat now. Fred Alter in the blue chip is running fifth place. Gales Rooster Tail is sixth and last. Tahoe misses in first place. Miss Bardall's in second place, and Notre Dame's in third. Roy Doobie's fourth in the Miss US five. Fifth place with Fred Alter. And Chuck Thompson takes another victory on the Detroit River in the Tahoe Miss. Boy, some great footage. <laughs>